Cancer patients are coming under increasing financial pressure, with some having to cut back on food because money's so tight. That's according to Macmillan Cancer, which says one in six patients is hit by increased costs and lost income. The charity says changes to the benefit system could leave some people more than £90 a week worse off. This is my debt. This is what I owe. And these For are Gail Lundy, things. living with cancer has been both physically and financially it's devastating. She's had to give up her job as a secretary. To Today's so survey of 1,500 cancer patients just, suggests over two-thirds are, like Gail, hit by lost income, with one in six forced to cut back on everyday essentials. I have so little money, I struggle every week for food. Um, there is no new clothes, new shoes, no nothing like that anymore. She relies heavily on the government allowance she gets, but there's real concern she may not be eligible in the future. The government is proposing to change the benefit system for working people who get sick, but who are expected to make a good recovery. It's proposing to put a 12-month time limit on the allowance they receive. After that, they'll be means tested and anyone with more than £16,000 worth of savings or who has a partner who earns more than £149 a week will lose their benefit. Campaigners say it could have a catastrophic effect on many who are already struggling. Well, many cancer patients simply take longer than a year to recover from, from the very powerful treatments that they receive. And, and Macmillan doesn't understand, therefore, why the government is penalising cancer patients simply for taking too long to get better. But the government insists support will not be cut for people unable to work. And for those no longer eligible, alternative benefits may be available. Sophie Hutchinson, BBC News.